What's going on everybody? I'm Daniel and welcome back to Frosty Reviews. Today is a very, very special review. I've been looking for this beer for a long ass time and I finally found it, baby. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Steve Austin's Broken Skull IPA. Uh, so this is what we're gonna be doing the review on. It's from Stone Cold himself. If you don't know what Stone Cold is, pause this video and go look at him right now. He's one of my favorite wrestlers from back in the 90s. The Attitude Era up to the 2000s. And a tribute to Stone Cold himself. I got my partner, my uh, partner in crime back there. He's gonna toss me my brewskis. Why do you have to say that? Give me another one. <laughs> Daddy. There goes the Stone Cold, Steve Austin. Here we get up on the top ropes, baby. Here you go, oh, hell yeah! Ooh, Daddy. Uh, stay frosty. What is up, all my frostos and frostettes? Here we are today on a special, special Frosty review. I grew up in the, in the 90s and the early 2000s as a child, and my dad introduced me to wrestling, especially WWF and WCW. It was called the Attitude Era. The best time to be growing up as a kid and watching wrestling was during this time. I was very lucky. You had guys like Goldberg, you had guys like Macho Man, Randy Savage, Hulk Hogan, the, NC, the, NC, uh, the NWO, the LWO, the Latino World Order. You had the Wolfpack, Kevin Nash. You had guys like The Rock and especially Stone Cold Steve Austin who really put it on the map. I've, dude, I've been a huge fan of Stone Cold for so many years. And um, I knew he had a beer called Broken Skull IPA, and I've been looking for this beer everywhere, literally everywhere. And lo and behold, it was literally, the other day I was at HEB looking for Frosties, and I stumbled upon the beer. Now, I showed the can in the intro, so if you want to look at it, go back. But this, from, this comes from El Segundo, or, yeah, El Segundo Brewing Company. Now, this is out of El Segundo, California, uh, where Steve Austin is actually living now. He lives in L.A. and kind of lives in Nevada as well. Uh, Broken Skull IPA. It is 6.7 alcohol by content or by volume. <laughs> alcohol by volume. Uh, this is 16 ounces. Let's see here. Broken Skull India Pale Ale. A badass 6.7% IPA designed by Steve Austin and El Segundo Brewing Company for the working man and woman. It features Citra, Cascade, and Chinook hops to deliver big flavor with an easy finish. Now stop reading and start enjoying this awesome beer. Cheers. Shout out to El Segundo. Man, this is a cool ass can. It's really, really cool. I really like it. They had the barbed wire on top. They got the skull down there. Man, stone cold. He, you knew as soon as his music, his intro music came on, that, that glass breaking, that somebody's ass was about to get stomped. About to stomp a mud, mud hole in your ass. Man, stone cold. Y'all remember whenever he pulled up in that beer truck and he freaking... Just lay down. It was a Coors Light truck. And Stone Cold got out with the actual hose. And he sprayed down Vince McMahon, Shane McMahon, and The Rock. And he just sprayed them all down with beer. Oh, my goodness. What a just a great character. I mean, just a great character. All right. This is a clear IPA. It is not hazy whatsoever. Okay. Has a little bit of a citrus fruity smell to it. Not too fruity though. It's, just, it's very, it's very mild. 
I'm excited. Let this sit for a little bit. I kind of had a little bit of an aggressive pour, but not too bad. It got a little bit of head there. What am I doing? Cheers to all my frostos and frostettes. Okay, it's different. It's balanced pretty good. The citrusy, fruity smell I tasted, or I tasted that I smelt, is very mild in the taste itself. But this has a little bit of a malt on the on the on the back end of it, but it's not heavy. I'm not big on the ex big malt taste, but um, this is not a bad beer by any stretch of the means. It's not it's not hoppy at all. No, it's not hoppy at all. I don't taste. That hoppy punch in mouth, I don't get it. It's really smooth and it has an easy finish, like the, like the can said. It's not it's not hard to drink at all. It's only six point seven, so it's not gonna you know it's not gonna knock your rocks, your rocks, knock your socks off. But it's not bad. It's not bad. <laughs> Whoa. Um. I don't mind the price. You get four 16 ounces for like 13 bucks. You know, it's not too bad. Uh, maybe it's a little overpriced because it's it's stone because it's stone cold beer. But I mean, I pay extra for it. You know what I mean? Uh, so we're still living in the Corona time, quarantine zone. I happen to be an essential personnel. So that's good. I'm, I'm thankful that I get to go to work still, and you know I'm not I'm not going through hard times like some good good American people are due to this fucking virus. But I'm thankful. I really am. But you know, if you can, you know, try to just relax, sit back, have some frosties, do some home projects, work out. It's a good time to get in shape. Especially a good time to drink Frosties. Unfortunately, Frosties, they cost a little bit of dough, though. It's going to run you up a bill, but... <sighs> what can you do? So, let's score this thing. <coughs> oh. So... I think, I think I'm going to give this almost, okay, it's not the worst IPA and it's not the best. I'll go ahead and say it. I will drink this beer again, but it's not like my favorite IPA by any stretch of the mean. So I want to give this a 6.9. 6.9 because number one, it's stone cold. I'm a little biased there, but the beer itself is not bad. Um, it's e it's really easy drinking, so that's a, that 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 has some that, that gave me some brownie points. The taste isn't like the best, but it's not the worst. If I see it again, I will buy it because it's good. It's not bad, you know. It's just not great. So there you have it. Oh. <laughs> I almost forgot. Today's hat is Payette Brewing Company. I got this hat when I was up in uh, Boise, Idaho. Really good beer, really good company. Today's shirt is Preaching from 
uh, Zero Foxtrot. So, badass shirt, badass hat, and a badass beard. And that's the bottom line, because Stone Cold said so. Thanks for joining in for this Frost Review, everybody. Uh, check them out. El Segundo Brewing Company, Broken Skull IPA. Stay frosty.